All right, this is uh, my project for Engineering 267. Uh, it's a projectile motion function. Uh, here's the function. And then we've got a GUI also for the function. We'll go ahead and run the GUI. You can see what the function does. Um, our initial values uh, that we're going to be plugging in are x0 and y0, which is our initial coordinates. Uh, v0 is our initial velocity. And then our angle, which is in degrees. We're going to start with these initial values here. Uh, you can also select which planet you're on. So we're going to start off with Earth. And then we'll just go ahead and plot these initial values. So it gives us our trajectory. It makes a red dot for the highest point. We change the angle to 30 degrees. See that we don't go quite as far. And then also change it to 60. And that just demonstrates that 30 degrees and 60 degrees have the same landing point. Um, let's try a few different planets. We can go to the moon, which should be quite a bit less gravity. And we can also do, let's do Mars also. And this basically just changes the gravitational constant g that is an input to the function. Alright, so that's my function. We also have a clear option. And we can also save a plot using the save button. It just creates a file called projectile.tiff. It's created this file here. And there's all of our data. So thanks for watching.